Good evening. Hi guys, can you hear me now? Oh, there you go. Yeah, I can. Thank All right. Hello, How are you? Everything good, everything good? Yes. All right, great. Sorry guys, uh, my microphone wasn't working for some reason. So that's everything, man. How was, how was your weekend? Good. Good. Did you, um, did you do anything interesting? No. no. For me, I visited my father. Oh, you visited your father. Your, your father. Okay. Um, where does he live at? Uh, he lives in North Carolina. In he lives. He, he lives. Lives in North Carolina. In. In North Carolina. Yes. So hold on, but so you, I guess your your dad came over here, came to El Salvador. Yes. Oh, that's why. Okay. That's nice. That's that's very nice. So did you go somewhere? No. No? No. Didn't. And All you? Right. Yeah. Uh, How was your weekend? It was good. It was good. Uh, I have a friend who's, who's leaving. And... Uh, we went to the beach, you know, and actually we and some coworkers went to the beach. So, so it was, it was pretty good. Um, I, I loved the ride there. It was pretty cool. Cause I never, uh, I've never been to the, I've never been in the zone from, you know, uh, Playa El Tunco and all that at, um, uh, after, uh, after they they built uh, the the they, they built uh, the the bridge you know so I hadn't been there before I mean be, before that I mean after that sorry you know I hadn't been there Your after city. that yeah so but it's, it was pretty cool like riding your motorcycle over there do it's it's awesome <laughs> it's really really cool you know so that's what I did in uh, and I got a haircut and my beard <laughs> so. There is that too, you know. Maria, Belen, how are you? Hi. Fine, Everything and good? you? Yes. Excellent, you. excellent. Okay, nice to see you here. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank how you. was um, how was your weekend? Uh, um, pretty good. I went to um. Forget the place um, in a uh, mountain. Oh, really? Yes, with my family. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Wow. Yes. Wow, that's that's cool. The, the, and you forgot the name? Uh, um, uh, uh, and Napaneca and. Oh, okay. So it's it's place. <laughs> okay. All right. That's awesome. All right. <clears throat> awesome. All right, guys. So, um, welcome aboard, guys. Happy Monday, everyone. Everyone. Um, 
so we're gonna get started guys guys um a platform okay so i'm gonna go over the main term right now guys if you need any help but that needs to be finished okay this week guys you pretty much need to finish the platform and the final exam i will recommend you finishing the platform already guys and start signing up for you know your next semester right for the next level now let me ask you something guys uh is there anybody here guys who hasn't finished the midterm um by the way guys turn on your cameras okay send the camera guys all right giovanni rodrigo ingrid david jose all right guys is there is there anybody here guys, who hasn't who hasn't finished the midterm i have a key guys what i have a key guys que no haya finalizado the midterm Todavía. Anybody? Giovanni. What happened to you, Giovanni? I'm very bossy, busy, busy this, uh, the last week, but I finish it, finished this night. Tonight, right? Tonight. Tonight. Okay, very good. Okay. Uh, Ingrid, Rafael, Jose, David, Rodrigo, Jenny, did you finish the, the, the midterm? Yes, yes, in my case, it's finished. Hello. It's done. Yes, in my case, too. All right, great. Thank you, guys. Thank you. You're awesome. Okay. All right, anyways, okay. Uh, good to see you. All right. So let's continue, guys. Uh, today, guys, is going to be practice. I promised we Hello. were going to have practice um, today, guys. So that's what we're going to do, okay? All right, so before we begin, guys, talking about model verbs, okay, let's wrap this up, guys. We're going to wrap up the topic of relative pronouns um, in general, okay? All right, so guys, just a quick review. Uh, Mailing, all right, give me an example of a relative pronoun. Oh. No? <laughs> no. Check your notes, okay? Right, take a look at your notebook, okay? Maria, give me an example of a of a, of a relative pronoun. Maria Belen. I am mute. Sorry. Okay. I saw the man who sold the car. All who right, sold me is, the car. Very good. Where is the relative pronoun there? Pronoun. Uh, where, Boo. Very good. By the okay, guys, one more thing, okay? If I say, guys, who are you? Where is the relative pronoun here? Hold on. If I say, who are you? Who? Are you sure? No. No, there is no relative pronoun yeah. here. Guys, okay, yeah. right? Don't get confused, okay? Guys. If you don't use the word who, right, which is the relative pronoun, right? If you don't use if you don't use the, the word who to join two ideas together, all right, that is not a relative pronoun. Got it? Okay. This is a WH word. Okay. Who are you? Okay. Got it? No confunda, guys. Si vos no estás usando el who para unir dos ideas, no es un, un, un relative pronoun. Got it? All right, is that clear, guys? All right, very good. All right, so relative pronoun, right? Uh, we have who, what else, guys? What else do we have as a relative pronoun? Which. Which, Which. okay, what that. else? That, that. Was. Uh, who's? Who? Very good, and we have whom, right? Very good, awesome. All right, very good, guys. So um, this is what I want you to do. This is what we're gonna do tonight, guys, okay? You have five questions here, okay? You're gonna talk, guys. I'm gonna go into each of your rooms and I'm gonna give you feedback on the spot, okay? At the end of the day, guys, I want I want you to practice them all, okay? However, we're gonna choose one at the end that you're gonna talk about. What we're gonna do is this, okay? After you practice, it's 10 of them, okay? So after you uh, finish practicing all 10 of them, um, we're gonna play a game, which is talk for a minute without mistakes, okay? So you have to talk for one minute, all right? If we don't have, if it is too too many of us guys, we're not gonna talk for one minute. We're gonna talk for like 30 seconds perhaps, okay? But the, the thing guys is to talk to up to one minute or just 30 seconds, okay? Without making any mistakes, okay? 
I'm gonna score each of you. So I'm gonna I'm gonna give your name, right? So I'm gonna say, for example, I don't know, Ingrid, right? Ingrid and grammar, maybe she didn't have any grammar mistakes. So she got two points in grammar. Maybe she didn't have any pronunciation mistakes. She had two points in grammar. Maybe she didn't have any vocabulary mistake. And she comes up with two extra points in grammar. Intonation to influence the two, right? So what's the total here, guys? If you add this up, what the what's the total that comes up? The total is 10, right? Got it? But let's say that you you your grammar was really bad, right? So maybe your grammar was really bad. I'm gonna give you a one here. Maybe pronunciation was okay, vocabulary is okay, you know, intonation was really, really bad. All right. Uh, and then your fluency was really bad too, you know. So how much is that? Right? Like four point five, right? Four point five. Okay, very good, guys. Okay, got it. So uh, this is what we're gonna do, guys. Okay, so prepare, practice one question, guys, until you know you don't have any mistakes. Okay, again, guys, I will give you feedback. Okay, I will give you, I will give you what, guys? Feedback. Feedback. Okay, so I will give you feedback. Okay, and I'm gonna give you this. Wait, what? What was it? <laughs> I forgot. Wait, how was it? <laughs> Damn. Oh, oh yeah, something like this, right? One. Like the old school. <laughs> yes, I remember. I forgot how to do that. That's like, 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 you know, teachers don't do that anymore, right? Anyways, anyways, okay. All right. Oh, uh, you need to take a screenshot, right? Hold on. All right, guys, do me a favor. Take a screenshot of each of these, right? Number one and number two. <clears throat> Let me know when you take the screenshot, guys. Ready? Screenshot. Screenshot is ready. Yes? OK. Take the screenshot of this slide, too. All right, ready? Okay, good guys, good. Okay then, so let's get together. Uh, practice guys, okay? I want everybody talking because otherwise the activity will not be good. All right, let's go. Hello, David. Tell me, David. Uh, currently I'm driving. So maybe I only listen the the class. Oh, okay. Thank you, David. Right. Jo join the the breakout session, though. Okay. Okay. Join the breakout session. Okay. Thank you. Ilda, are you there? Oh, there you go. Uh, could you add me at the at the group, please? Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. Thank you. All right. Did you get the invitation? Did you get the invitation, David? Great. Great. Yeah. Let's start. Okay. Let's start. Let's do it. You can share the 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 picture. Yes. Yes. The first question is: Do you have a plan to live in another city? Yeah, yeah, I can hear you. Is that a friend who lives in another city? Yes, I have a friend. I have a lot of friends in another city. I have to talk about him? Mm -hmm. Okay. I have a, my best friend, he lives in the United States. 
Uh, actually, uh, let me let me uh, let me interrupt you for a moment, okay? It's uh, she lives in the United States, yes. and this is something that uh, write it down, guys. Okay, this is for everybody. Okay, when you talk about hold on, I'm gonna mute you for a moment. Somebody has a lot of background noise, guys. Anyways, when you talk about countries in general, I mean countries that are plural, that that who's well, um, which names are in plural. You need to add the article the, right? Again, so si tenés un nombre de un país que es en plural, right? Like when I say United States, right? It's plural, right? Yes. So you need to say the United States, right? For example, the this Netherlands, right? Take a look at this Netherlands, right? Holanda, right? Netherlands. That's the name in English. You got it? So how do you say it? You say the Netherlands, right? Because it's in plural, okay? All right, very good, continue. Continue. happened can you hear me yes okay are you I finished have... uh, okay. Oh. Okay. i can i can hear you okay yes. i have a, i have a friend i have a friend in another city in another oh. country okay it's my turn okay okay yes i have a i have um, a friend in the United States. She is um, my best friend because when I have a child, uh, she share with the toys and share the school too. I'm sorry, it's because when I, in the past, right, when I had, not when I have, all right? Wait, all right, notice, notice how funny that is because when you say, when I have a child, if you say, I have, when I have a child, it means that you have a lot of, child, of, of children, I'm sorry, right? It means like you, you have children very frequently, okay? See so what this is, when I have child, it's like saying, cuando tengo hijos, right? <laughs> that sounds like you have, you have children every day, huh? <laughs> No. You're pretty busy. <laughs> no. All right. Very good. Very good. Right. Continue then. Okay. Oh, Spanish. No Spanish, guys. I I don't remember the third uh, question. I love to buy food. For why? I think yes, this no. is really... Hubo una palabrita que dudé si era tasty. Tasty. Or tasty. Yes. Uh, I, okay, okay. All right. Remember that the whole idea is for you to talk for one minute without making mistakes, right? So that's okay. that's the whole point. All right. Very good. So let me hear you. Also, also, you know, I want you to answer using relative pronouns, right? You can say, can you think of, let's let's talk about the third one, which is the one that you were talking about. Can you think of something that you'd love to buy? Why would you like to buy it, right? So you can say, I'd like to buy food that is healthy for me, see? I'm joining two ideas together, right? Okay. Two ideas together, right? I'm joining, uh, I, I, I'd like to buy food and then food that is healthy right i'd like i'd like to buy food that is healthy yes right or you can say which yes. is healthy right i'd like to buy food which is healthy okay all right use the relative pronoun in 
each question. I mean, you can answer, you can use them, right? That's that's the whole thing. Try to use them naturally. Okay, Maria Belen, how are you? Hey, uh, Maria Belen, uh, <laughs> talk about the time when you had when you were in a difficult situation. What do you do? In a difficult, I, yes, maybe for me, a difficult uh, when uh, when I stayed uh, in a uh, I don't know. Uh, say uh, what do you say in English? Entrevista. Interview. Yes, I think and uh, that. Let me see. Mm, for me, in a difficult situation, that uh, in a uh, interview, because normally I nervous. Okay. Oh, really? Yes. Okay. Yes. <laughs> so you're usually nervous when you go to an interview? Yes. Yes. Occasionally. Okay. All right. Well, it's what do you normal, mean? Right. Yeah, it's normal. It's, it's, I mean, it's, it's normal to be nervous, right? But why do you say occasionally? Because you don't have too many interviews, do you? Mm, no, maybe. Well, the last, no. These years, uh, I I have three interview. This and year then, I have. What's wrong there, Giovanni? Uh -huh. I have this year. I have three interviews. Is that correct, Giovanni? Had. Had right. Had the yes, past. I, yes, I had three interview, and then three a, interview. Three interview. Three. Interview, interview, three I interview. Know. I don't know. You tell me three interview. What's wrong there? <laughs> what's wrong there, Giovanni? What's wrong? Three interview. Plural. What's wrong with three? Plural, yes, Plural. right. Three interviews, uh, yes. right? Yes, all right. Yes. Okay, all right. Very good. Continue. All right now, do me a favor, correct each other's mistakes. Okay, if you hear Giovanni, if you hear her, you know, saying three interview again. All right, correct her. All right, you need to tell her. No, that's not how you say it. <laughs> okay. Right. Very good. Continue, guys. Good job. Uy. No, Maylin. I. There you go, Hilda. I'm sorry. I thought that you were alone, Maylin. No, right. sorry, because my internet is is like to microphone. <laughs> oh, okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So, so, so tell me. So tell me what. Um, so let's practice, okay? Let's go. I want to hear you. Notice that you can answer using relative pronouns, okay? I want to hear you answering using relative pronouns. For example, question number three says, can you think of something that you'd love to buy? Why would you like to buy it? So you can say, for example, I'd like to buy food that is healthy for me. See? That is healthy for me, right? So I'm using a relative pronoun to join two ideas together, right? I'm joining the, the fact that I want to buy food and that I want to buy healthy food, okay? okay. Got it? So, I, all right. I say, for example, I like to, I love to buy a new cell phone that is better than half. That is, okay, I love, I love to buy a cell phone that is better than the one I have. Ah, uh, thank you. All right, say it, say it, say it. I'd like to buy a cell phone, I'd, okay? No, don't, don't say I. I'd like to buy a cell phone which is better than the one I have. All right, let me hear you. Okay, um, in my case, um, I, uh, in my case, uh, I like the, I, I like love to buy, um, Smart TV, uh, <laughs> but you, you what? I'm sorry. Um, buy the smart TV seven inch. Okay, I'd like to buy a seven inch a seven inch TV. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, but the, the complement the the the, the center. 
but okay. I don't know, but I don't understand if a kid. All right, very good, very good, okay. All right, very good. Uh, yes, that is correct. You can say that, okay. Um, but you can say, right, I, I, I want you to add the relative clause, okay? okay. So continue. <laughs> hey guys, okay, let me hear you guys. Okay. Oh, yeah. Guys, I remember to use relative pronouns, okay, right? Let me hear you, Ricardo. Let's go, Ricardo, Rafael, Jose. Let me hear you guys. Relative pronouns, the definition. What is what? I'm sorry. So what what are you practicing, guys? What are you doing? <laughs> we are resolved as questions in the in the screenshots. Which questions? No, oh. you, you need to talk, guys, about the questions that we sent in the screenshot. Okay. Um, questions from the screenshot. You're gonna practice, guys, talking. Okay. All right. That's what you need to do. You're gonna ask each other's questions. Okay. That's what I say. You're gonna practice, and you're gonna, you're not gonna make mistakes when you speak. Okay. You're gonna be able to talk for one minute without, for one minute, without making mistakes, and that's the point. All right. So I want to hear you guys asking question number one to, let's say, Rafa, right? Ask question number one to Ricardo, Ricardo to Jose, etc. Okay. Okay, okay. All right. Let me hear you then, guys. Okay. Ricardo, how do you feel about people who talk too much? Uh, sometimes I have not a topic for talk and I think that these people are interesting because we talk with a lot of time, with, with a lot of topics, but only that uh, for me is interesting. But people And for you, what do you like? What do you like to visit a country where people eat unusual food? Can you think of such a country? Um, right now, I only saw documentals about people <laughs> eating unusual food and in that in countries that people eat like uh, snakes and what country are you talking about i i think about in indian people do they eat snakes and some regions, like some, oh, scorpions. scorpions, scorpions. I saw documentals that really well. We eat, we eat, um, lizard here, <laughs> okay. you know. So, I mean, that's weird, right? That's that's weird too. All right, very good, guys. Continue. But material mind, you got that situations because if, if your life is is coming around or the material things you had or you have a bad situations, but your uh, the fees in, inside. Uh, of you 
always you are very happy and there's not a big problem i think okay well what are you talking about okay we were talking about the the sentence number four talk about time when you were a difficult situation a time where you had a difficult situation okay all right very good very good guys so anyways um we're gonna go back now guys okay we're gonna play that small game all right and uh let's see how it goes okay let's go guys let's go back. all right welcome back guys good to see you okay so this is what we're gonna do okay you or each of you is going to talk for 30 seconds not one minute okay 30 seconds because otherwise we're not gonna have enough time all right so you're gonna talk for 30 seconds without making any mistakes okay let's see yeah, I think 30 seconds is enough, okay? Now, who wants, who would like to get the timer, guys? I'm gonna say this in English and Spanish, okay? First of all, guys, okay, I need someone to help me with the timer. Necesito que alguien me ayude, guys, poniendo 30 segundos en su celular y que me diga stop. Cada vez que se terminen los 30 segundos para que la persona termine de hablar. Got it? All right, who wants to help me do that? ¿Quién quiere ayudarme con eso? Help me. All right, thank you, Maria Belen. All right, very good. Now, everybody else, guys, todos los demás, okay? I want you to listen to the person, right? And write down mistakes, okay? So you're gonna listen to the person, right? Listen to the person and write down any mistakes that you hear, okay? Van a escuchar, guys, y van a escribir cualquier error que escuchen de la persona, okay? Got it? Todos, mientras están escuchando, eso es lo que van a hacer, got it? All right, very good. All right, so what are the two things that we're going to do right now, guys? ¿Qué son las dos cosas que vamos a hacer? ¿Qué ustedes tienen que hacer? What are the two things that you have to do? Identify what is the mistakes. All right, you listen, right? And you write down the mistake, right? And the other person, la persona enfrente, talks for how long? ¿Por cuánto tiempo tiene que hablar la persona enfrente? 13. 30, 30 seconds, okay, 30 segundos, okay? Without mistakes, okay? No mistakes. Got it? All right? Sin errores, guys, okay? Anyways, okay. Uh, who wants to be the first one? Can you get us a primero? Nobody? Okay, I'll, I'll pick then, okay? I'll just pick whoever I see first, okay? Let's start with um, Jenny Quesada. Let's go, Jenny. Uh, I need to talk about something you need to talk about okay this is what i explained at the beginning guys you need mm -hmm. to talk about one question from the ones i sent you okay tienen que hablar de una pregunta de, de las que les envié al grupo okay la que han estado practicando got it the one that you've been you've been practicing yes yes guys all right okay. jenny are you ready no not yet <laughs> okay right ricardo okay. you want to do oh, oh, there oh, you go there you go okay uh, Hold on. Three. Maria, Maria Belen. Timer at three, two, one. Let's go. Okay. Um, I usually buy things that I don't really need. Um, because when I go with my son, uh, he, 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 <laughs> okay, very good. <laughs> All right, Sorry. good job. Plus for, plus for Jenny. Good job. Okay. Jenny, that was actually pretty good. Okay. I'm going to give you this score. Okay. In grammar, I'm going to give you a two because you didn't, you did not make any grammar mistakes. So good job. Okay. Good grammar. All right. Pronunciation. It's son, not 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 tongue, okay? Tongue, if you, tongue is another thing, okay? 
All right. Uh, very good. The, the other thing, um, pronunciation, right? I'm going to give you 1.5 here just because that was two sentences, okay? Vocabulary was was good. No mistakes with the vocabulary. Intonation, you paused too, for too long, okay? It was two sentences. So let me say the oraciones, okay? So that's too long, but so I'm going to give you intonation. I mean, uh, intonation two here because um, it was good intonation. And fluency, I'm going to give you one, right? So total score, two... I think, guys, we can do it for one minute. Well, let's try 30 seconds, guys, depending on the time, okay? So two, four, six, seven, hold on, two, four, six, seven, eight point five, right? Out of 10, right? Good job, plus for Jenny. Well done, Jenny. All right, guys, do you have any other mistakes from, from Jenny? Did you hear anything else? No? All right, no, okay, all right. Very good. 8.5. That's good, Jenny. Jenny, pick someone else. Hmm. Ricardo? Ricardo. All right. Ricardo, let's go. Okay. All right. Okay. I think it's, it's rain, so. It's okay. We can hear you. We, we don't hear the rain. Don't worry. Okay. Three, uh, two, about the, one. Go. Okay. About the things that I really don't need for for my life. Uh, I installed the AliExpress application uh, last year and I tried to buy uh, things from China. Uh, for example, a smartwatch that is really strange in this country, in my country. And right now uh, the battery is dead and I can buy another battery because in this country we don't have. Very a, good. A plus for Ricardo. A, okay, good job, Ricardo. All right. Yeah, let's do, guys. Let's do forty-five. All right, Maria Belen. Let's 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 increase it. Is let's increase it a little bit to forty-five seconds. Okay, because it's it's very short. I think we I think we can even do a minute. Okay. You know what, guys? Let's do a minute. Okay. Bring it bring it up to one minute, Maria Belen. One minute. Okay. One whole minute. All right. Okay, very good, guys. So, very good. So, Ricardo, okay. Um, good. Uh, I'm going to give you this score, okay. I, I think you had great grammar. All right, grammar was great. You did not, I didn't hear any grammar mistakes. Uh, we're going to talk about pronunciation too. Uh, soon, I'm sorry. Vocabulary was, was okay. Intonation was kind of okay. I'll, I'll explain to you why, right? And fluency was better. I, I actually liked your fluency, okay. Now, pronunciation, we have three mistakes in three seconds, you know. I'm going to give you one here. Now, you, you talked in the past, right? So the pronunciation is, I installed an app. Repeat, I installed. I installed. Very good, okay. I installed an app. Repeat, I installed an app. I installed an app. I installed the app. I installed the app. No, no, no. The like app. this guy, Sorry. you say, I installed, right? Everybody repeat, I installed. An app. I install an app. All right, guys, to, to pronounce this correctly, guys, you need to say like this. I install and then say the app, okay? This is called a liaison, right? Eso se llama liaisons or connected speech, okay? Liaisons, okay? We connect words together, okay? We connect sounds, okay? Repeat, guys. I installed an app. I installed an app. I installed an app. Repeat, I installed say, an app. say this, guys. Say this, okay? Say this, all right? I installed an app like this guy. I installed the app. I installed an app. I installed. I installed an app. I installed the app. I installed the app. That not the app. The app guys. I installed an app. I installed the app. Okay, so the so guys, this is how, how this is this right here, guys. Is how you read this, okay? I installed an app. I installed an app yesterday, right? I installed an app yesterday. I installed an app yesterday. All right, got it? Así es como lo lees, okay? All right, very good. So you have three, Ricardo. So total score comes up to two, three, five, seven, eight point five out of 10. Am I right? 8.5 out of 10. Very good, a plus for Ricardo, guys, okay? Good job, Ricardo. All right, very good. So Thanks. it's gonna be one minute now. Ricardo, pick someone else. Write down mistakes, guys, because I'm gonna ask you, okay? Pick someone else, Ricardo.